Hi everyone, we are going to start our fourth week of birthday month and today we are going to talk about nostalgia. So let's start with a video. Meats keep meatier, beets keep beatier, chips keep chippier, dips keep dippier, Tupperware freshness, that's our promise. Look at all the ways we keep it. Come to a Tupperware party and see all the new ways you can lock in freshness. Beets, green cheese, teas, potato, tomato, salami, pastrami, jams keep jammier, hams keep hammier, cakes keep cakier, flakes keep flakier, Tupperware freshness, that's our promise. Look at all the ways we keep it. Oh my God. So when I, I'm seeing all those products, I, I cannot stop smiling. Uh, it reminds me so much uh, souvenir. So we're gonna start with a quiz. Okay, so everyone, you have to use the chat to share your answer. So first question, I'm going to ask you, what are, are the first two products that invented and marketed by Earl Topper in 1946? Okay, go in the chat and share your answer. We want to know who is the big, big, big connoisseur from Tupperware. Of course, we have our That's a Ball and the Tumblr. Yes, the Bell Tumblr are the two first product invented by Earl Tupper. Okay, number two, in what year? Did they appear several year canister? So in which year they were created? Mm, it was in the 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s, 90s. In 1962. Yay! Oh my god. And we we, we have so much uh, you know souvenir when we see those kind of canister. Okay, number three. What product appeared in the 90, 1960s to keep lettuce crisp? I'm sure you are going to know that is the crisp it. Yes. So that was a real great product. And a lot of households still use them, use the, this product. Okay. What product was sold first? Okay. Was it the... Uh, popsicle thing, the shape of toy, or the quick shake? Okay, go in the chat. And the answer is yes, the popsicle. I was very surprised. 1952, it's one of the first product. And then shape of toy in 1967, and the quick shake in 1972. Okay. What is the name of the ancestor of French Mart and in what year did it appear in the catalog? Hmm. I'm sure you know this product. And I'm sure you're going to recognize this Tupper lady. We all love Maria Tupperware. And yes, this is our um product the product in 1982 yes and that was a big 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 seller in that time all right so as you know there's so much product and i love this uh, timeline because you can see which product was um brought on the uh, in the catalog and when so it's a uh, very very cool to see that modular mates in, is from the 80s but fridge smart rock and serve are from the 90s and then we had more the um the the cooker and all the the stuff that uh, we use now like the um, uh, multi cooker the micro grill and still the stack cooker in the 90s all right so today um this week, yes, uh, we think, you know what? It's birthday month. Let's talk about our past, our roots. So this week, make a nostalgic post with a product from the past that reminds you sweet moments from the past. So maybe you're going to take a picture of your oldest product and ask people to share their oldest product. Uh, maybe you are going to find this product uh, on uh, Google and you're going to talk about uh, a product that you you use when you were a kid or you're going to just uh, remind some uh, souvenir. So this is uh, 
the way we are going to do it this week. So submit your proof and you are going to participate to the draw. And when you do it, the, the post, you can claim your $100 of Tupperware for $40. All right. So for me, cereal bowls remind me my friend Mano. Yes, uh, when I was at her house, uh, her mother used to serve us chip in those bowls. And at home, we didn't have those bowls. And a little bit later, my mom, my mom did a Tupperware party. And I remember she placed all the chair all around the, the salon. So I, I remember she, she had like, a, she was expecting like 30 people in her head. I think like a seven shows. <laughs> and but I remember it was fun and they did some games and they uh, asked me to uh, tell my name with a quality beginning by the first letter of my um, name and I remember still I said okay I'm Sylvain and I'm um, serviable in French uh, uh, servanthood so uh, I remember that and uh, all the ladies laugh uh, to my uh, my comments all right so i remember those uh wonder your bowl and the um the big wonders and this is my oldest Tupperware product at home yes and i like to show it because you know it's still work and i love to keep let's say um um a pie inside or something like this yeah okay so i ask a, a few of my colleagues and they say Let's say May, Ma she said that um, when she was at uh, her house, uh, no, uh, aunt houses, she served her uh, Kool-Aid <laughs> and it was only at that place that she can drink Kool-Aid. So that uh, picture remind this. Melanie uh, Fontaine, she said, you know, that vintage uh, kids classic topper dish. Uh, yeah, I think she love it. Look at her picture now. <laughs> <laughs> she, she she told me that it was her bad toy. My mother's um uh, still has it, and my brother has children from one to three years old who still play with it at grandma house. Oh my god, can you imagine uh, a, a toy that lasts so for so long? Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, and I have my friend uh, Jessica. She um, shared with me that uh, the beige condiment tray reminds me of my family dinner at my grandmother's. She made her homemade ketchup that she put in it, and I was so young. And for me, ketchup equal uh, ein, so I never even taste her homemade ketchup. So, you know, we all have souvenir related at uh, Tupperware. So this week, it's uh, our birthday. Can you imagine? 77 years. So it's time to go on social media and share let's say something from nostalgia okay just talk about a whole product just a souvenir and you're gonna find a, a lot of uh, things you can do you can do reels post picture video live and just make sure to share on um, salesforce uh, under the comments so thanks everyone and have a great week